guys, what is up? It is Rosa and welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be talking about what sold on Poshmark the last week or so. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a huge thumbs up if you like it. Subscribe if you haven't yet. Join the Bright Patch fan room. We have fun here all the time. Let's go ahead and get started with the video though. The first item is this ASOS Grey Star print crew neck sweater. I sold it for $22. My Poshmark fee was $4.40. I also gave a shipping discount for this and my net earnings were $16.10. The next item I sold was a Free People We The Free striped peplum top. This thing was sitting in my closet for like literally eons and it didn't sell. Free People doesn't really sell that fast for me but sometimes I try to still experiment with it but still it doesn't really sell that fast for me so. This was priced at $22, but my Poshmark fee for my Poshmark P, my Poshmark fee was $4.40, so my net earnings were $17.60 for this guy. Next, this is kind of a really interesting sale. This was a Robert Graham women's top, and I made sure it was women's because the way that you can tell if it's women's or men's is where the buttons are. So the buttons were on the side that women's tops are, so hence why I made it a women's shirt. This girl questioned me, and I was like, yeah, look at the buttons. The buttons are on this side. She goes, okay, and then she bought it. So um, the price that she paid was $18. My Poshmark fee was $3.60, so my net earnings on it was $14.40. Now, I know I could sell Robert Graham for more, but like... It was, like, I had it priced at 40 bucks, but, like, I had it for way too long. So, I got rid of it real quick, and I still made two times more of what I paid for it. Next, we have this, which I'm so excited it sold fast. This is an Ellen Tracy top. It is the Ellen Tracy French Bulldog Color Block Blouse. I sold it for $20. My Poshmark fee was $4.00 but I also gave a shipping discount on it, which was $1.50, so my net earnings were $14.50. Next, I sold one of my own products. Products, I make things, just kidding. This was a swimsuit that I just don't fit anymore, so I put it on Posh, so I sold it for also super cheap. This is an Old Navy polka dot low back one piece swimsuit. The price that the customer paid was $10. My Poshmark fee was $2.95, so it left me with $7.05. And with something being Old Navy and mine, like I was totally fine with taking the $7.05 and walking. Next we have another Polo Ralph Lauren. I love finding Ralph Lauren. I think it is, if it's in really good condition, you pick it up, you'll get some money for it. This is the a Polo Ralph Lauren Imperial Blue V-neck sweater. It was new with tags. I sold it for $28. My Poshmark fee, my Poshmark fee, my Poshmark fee, I cannot talk, was $5.60 and my shipping discount was $1.50, so my net earnings were $20.90 for this top. Next was a Guinevere open knit long sleeve cardigan. It was a size medium. My price was $28. Poshmark fee was $5.60 and my shipping discount was $1.50 so I earned $20.90. This was such a pretty cardigan. I love finding anthro cardigans especially. Everything kind of moves slow for me so I can't say if this moves fast or not because everything kind of like steadily is slow for me. So the next item I sold was my Labyrinth t-shirt. You guys know that I love buying graphic tees of like movies and things like that. So I was happy this guy sold. I buy all of my tees for super, super cheap. So I did take a cheaper offer for this one. I sold um, this t-shirt for $14. My Poshmark fee was $2.95. My shipping discount was $1.50. So my net earnings on this guy was $9.55. Next item was finally Cloth and Stone. You guys know that I've been sitting on Cloth and Stone for such a long time but they're finally starting to sell thank the lord i sold this cloth and stone polka dot chambray top for 17 dollars my poshmark fee was three dollars and 40 cents my shipping discount was a dollar 50 so my net earnings were 12 dollars and 10 cents and the reason i sold it for super cheap by the way is because it did have a rip in the bag which i disclosed i still got five stars for it so Next, we have this Current Elliott top, which I've had forever as well. Current Elliott clothing doesn't sell as well as the jeans, but I still picked it up because I needed something for my closet, and it was still Current Elliott, so I was all like, why not, girl? I sold it for $17. My Poshmark fee was $3.40. My shipping discount was $1.50, and my net earnings were $12.10 on that bad boy. Finally, God help Stitch Fix. I swear, Stitch Fix is definitely going woo for me. 
I'm not gonna pick up any more Stitch Fix stuff just because, well, except Market and Spruce. I freaking love Market and Spruce. But like 41 Hawthorne is definitely out of my closet at this point. I just really wanna, I don't wanna deal with it because not only does it stay forever, it sells for low for me. So I'm just gonna get rid of it at this point. I'm not getting rid of it, but I mean like I'm not just gonna, I'm not gonna pick it up anymore is all. So I sold it for $17. My Poshmark fee was $3.40. My shipping discount was $1.50. So my net earnings were $12.10. Next, I love this brand, Parker. If you guys find it, it's a great brand to pick up. This was a 100% silk pink ruffle front sheer blouse. I sold it for $36. My Poshmark fee was $7.20. My Poshmark discount or my shipping discount was $1.50. So my net earnings were $27.30. I love Park. I love Parker. I, I sold two really quickly. So I guess Parker goes fast, I guess. I don't know. Next we have Soul Cycle. You guys know that I love selling Soul Cycle as well. Um, this was actually a Spirit jersey. It wasn't actually a Soul Cycle brand, but it was Spirit. So I sold this guy for $20. My Poshmark fee was $4 and my so my net earnings were $16. I did not give a shipping discount on it. All right, this is such a oh, this is a really nice sale. It wasn't like my best sale ever or anything like that, but it was a meaningful sale. I sold this to one of you guys and thank you so much. If you guys DM me or anything, you guys know that I'm down to give you a good deal on something. I actually sold this to one of you, so I'm not going to mention who or anything like that because of privacy, you know what I mean? But this was a Hannah Anderson Nordic wool blend sweater. This was a Hannah Anderson Nordic wool blend sweater. I sold her. I sold to her for twenty dollars, so my earnings were sixteen dollars. Um, so if you guys ever want anything from my hauls, just DM me on, on my Briar Rose Style Instagram. We can work something out. All right, and then the final item is Club Monaco. Now I've been learning to love Club Monaco because it actually sells for decent for me. But I'm really picky with my Club Monaco. Like it can't just be like some like T-shirt or like a I don't know, just like anything basic. I like to pick up something interesting. So this was a Club Monaco tie front crop cardigan. I sold it for $30. My Poshmark fee was $6. So my net earnings were $24 on it. I liked, I liked selling it. I like selling Club Monaco. Let me tell you, it's cute, it's fun. It's a change. It's, I sell so many different things on my Poshmark. Like you guys know, I don't have a brand. I don't have like, I'm not girly, I'm not tomboy. Anyways, that was everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed kind of knowing what I sold the last couple of weeks. It was probably the last week and a half. It's starting to pick up a little bit for me, which is really nice because uh, I have to take some unpaid vacations coming up soon. I think I have to take some in January and I'm taking one to this week. So this is gonna be a really great supplement for days where I have to take, that, that I, I have to take off work without pay. So definitely happy that Poshmark is starting to get it together and things actually, fun fact, I haven't sold anything this weekend on Poshmark. <laughs> Nothing, but eBay has been doing well this week, so eBay won this week, but I still love having these two platforms to sell on because if you're not making money on one, you'll be making money on the other and vice versa. You have two ways of selling things. Anyways, if you guys like this video, make sure to give it a huge thumbs way, way up. Subscribe if you have the Angel the Bright Patch fan, but we have fun here all the time. Make sure to hit that bell button next to the subscription button where you will be notified for my future videos. As well, I have, I have two more things. I feel like my my exits are getting longer and longer, but I mean, sometimes you gotta tell people things, you know what I mean? Um, number one, make sure to check me out on Instagram. My Briar Rose style Instagram is resale, and then Briar Rose 91 is my travel lifestyle Disney type Instagram if you guys like that kind of stuff. Also, check out my affiliate links down on the description. If you guys buy through those affiliate links, you will be supporting my channel so that's really awesome and I thank you guys so much for doing that and yeah that's everything I love you guys so much and I will see you guys all in the next video bye, -bye. yo what's up I'm the mad hatter I'll pour you tea please don't let it spread her. does it really matter cause I'm the mad hatter <laughs>